Hi, my name is Farul Arora and I am currently working as a security operations center engineer that is SOC engineer at a company based in Belfast, UK. Prior to that, I have been working as a cyber security consultant in a startup in Tokyo, Japan. And after that, I have worked as a cyber security analyst for roughly 1.5 years in a small firm based in New Delhi, India. So my career journey, my career journey is as follows. I did BCA, that is Bachelor's of Computer Applications from New Delhi, India. After that, I pursued postgraduate diploma in management in supply chain operations. And this is how I transitioned into cyber security. I did MSc in applied cyber security from the Queen's University of Belfast. So as for the day to day challenges which I face in my in my current job role, it is what well, it is. Uh, since you know that cyber security domain is very, very volatile. So we so they are many. See, cyber threat intelligence plays a major role in the day to day security operations. For example, when I was working as a cyber security consultant in Tokyo, so we have to map all the TTPs that is tactics, techniques and procedures for APT 37, APT 38, etc because we have to refine the same on daily basis because we cannot deploy our all the resources on all the ttps we have to refine them and we have to cater to the specific things because if you don't refine if you don't refine the ttps for the different sophisticated attackers then the cost of the same or cost of the resources goes very high and we cannot afford them because we have to save our resources CTIA from BC Council has helped me a lot in my career as with the help of this program I have gained all the theoretical knowledge as well as the practical knowledge for the cyber security domain spe specifically in threat intelligence. Uh, with the help of this course I gained the theoretical knowledge, knowledge as well as the practical knowledge. Uh, I, know, I know now more clearly the concepts of cyber threat intelligence model, uh, cyber, cyber kill chain methodologies difference between tactical threat intelligence, strategic threat intelligence, etc. Uh, I know many more tools like Multigo. Uh, I can do the link analysis now more clearly and it helps me for the tracing of the threats and doing my work more efficiently. I like the program very much as I have taken this course when I was working as a cyber security consultant in Tokyo and i cleared my exam after that when i was in new delhi i really like this course as i i have taken the three-day training program and the training was in by easy council instructor and he cleared all my concepts the learning was in depth and it was very practical and we learned open source intelligence how do we use the open open source scripts available how do we use uh, multi-go sublister um, and many many other tools which are available and the training was really really uh, beneficial for my career so there are many many things which i liked about the CTIA program so the first one is the knowledge of the ec council instructor so i have taken a three days training program from ec council and then the knowledge of the instructor was uh, up to the top he had a very good knowledge and he helped me with all the queries which i had on the real time basis he didn't delay any time the second is the course content if you see the course content of this program it is set as per the industry standards and which will really help you in your career the third is the practical scenario when you do the course and when you learn on when you learn online with the course instructor we have a lot of practical components and which really help me a lot and which really help you if you do this course so after the certification of CTIA, I have done two courses. One is NEC Security Associate, which is done from Fortinet. And the second is Cyber Arc Trustee, which is done by the company Cyber Arc. So if I want to compare these two courses with CTIA, the CTIA course training was far much better as they had a practical component. And these two courses were all theory and they didn't have that much practical component which I learned from CTIA and the best part of CTIA was that it was done by an online instructor and all these two courses were only online so you, it, you can do as per your wish but it was all theoretical. 
So with the help of the CTI course, I have learned in depth about the TTPs, how to use Multico, how to use open source intelligence tools. And the instance which I can think of at the moment is that uh, since we have to work on firewalls, we have to mitigate the real-time attacks, bot attacks, malicious requests, etc. So uh, with the help of TTPs, uh, we have to define that what kind of rule we want to create to block the block the request because we cannot block all the requests because it will create a lot of false positive so with the help of ttps we define that uh, which request we want to block and what kind of uh, threat actors we will choose to block the request because we cannot block the request by ips because this will be a havoc if we do that so we have to refine it and after measuring the ttps and after mapping it with the apts we think that and we think and test the rules and once all is all is good then we create and we block the malicious request my advice would be that before appearing the exam go through the course content thoroughly as the course content is very deep and is very extensive go through all the training videos and if you have any questions you can ask the ec hostel trainer when you are taking the training you should go through the cyber security news every day as you don't know what knowledge can help you in the exam. CTI course is a very specific course which will help you to gain the knowledge about all the TTPs, all the types of threat intelligence, collection techniques, open source intelligence tools, etc. SOC means Security Operations Center. I am I am also working as a SOC engineer in Belfast, UK. So, with the help of the CTI course, you will be able to understand how the security operations work and how in daily life you can incorporate all the OSINT techniques. So, uh, I have used many times Sublister, Multigo in my day to day operations. From the CTI course, you will have all the knowledge which can be practically implemented in your day to day op security operations.